<laughs> Welcome to Jeopardy. We're jumping straight into the action. Let's go. Uh, should we still be on team? Yeah. Yep. Okay. I think I know who we're gonna play as. Yeah. Is yeah. That be, can Robbie fit? I think it will. Uh, good old Robbie Rotten here. I don't know if there's any characters that look much like him though. Actually, that one had somewhat similar hair color. Um, I don't know. Uh, yeah, that one, that one, maybe. Uh, it's the one that wears purple? Or blue? Or... I wish there was a bit more selections here, but... Yeah. If I get that one I saw before, the dude would be... One. You know, it's close enough. That's yeah. the best I can get. Larry, yeah. Barrel, and Barrel. I think we played against her before. Myths and Legends okay. starts with an F. Nicknames. I think we could do one of these two. Yeah. Uh, what's this one? Stay calm, like computers. You'd be good at that one, maybe. Let's give it a shot. Rams, oh, centuries. Oh, does it mean calm as in communist? Oh, or just, I think it's just words that start with calm. Okay. I think. Centuries greatest. Commerce? No, Brams is a place, though. Commercial. Composer. Uh -huh. oh, we're completely off by that. Okay. Well, let's get away from that one. Uh, Starts with F? Sure. Proceeds, arrest, and teeth. What? Proceeds. Like a word that proceeds. Arrest? F Filing? No. I don't really... No. I don't know what either. False. False arrest? False teeth? Okay. Oh, I see. Okay, yeah. False teeth. One dance with this kind of praise. Praise. Foul praise? Larry over here. Faint. Wow, I've never heard that either. Nicknames. Has yeah. a sly way with success. Don't know anything about actors or directors. Nope. <coughs> I don't know much. Barrel seems to know. Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> they call him Fritz to Jimmy Carter's grits. So, Jimmy Carter's vice president? I have no idea. Jimmy Carter, he's still around. Yeah? Yeah, he's in his 90s, I think. Did so. he participate or give his two cents about the election? I don't know, I'd have to look it up. I know uh, some previous presidents did. He lived backward uh, in time. King Arthur's magician. Oh, Merlin! Wait, was that right? Is that King Arthur's magician. Oh, magician, yeah. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, um, like the previous George, the both George Bushes, actually. But the bushes, yeah. Yeah. And Jeb. I not have any thoughts on that, but... Uh, um, I think myths and legends could be a little bit fast. Yeah, let's try it. Oh! Go... Uh, wait, we can bet up to... Between five and a hundred. I'd say go... F oh, wait, really? That's it? Yeah. Oh, do the full thing. Yes, yeah, well, yeah. I thought uh, we could go up to a thousand, but that's in the... fee fi fo fum I smell the blood of an English Fee... Or is... Wait, is fee spelled F-E? Phi. Fo, so F O. Fum. What? Well, that is. Okay. That's the answer, though. Oh, yeah, again, spelling, for goodness sakes. <laughs> yeah, and on the actual show, you say the answers. Yeah, so spelling doesn't really matter. No. 
This archer is the national hero of Switzerland. It can't be Robin Hood, is it? It might be. Oh, no. William... William Tell? Oh. As in the William Tell Overture? Perhaps? Scotland. Shakespeare's Scottish Kings. Any oh. idea? Scottish? I could think of King Lear. Macbeth. Oh. oh. Huh. Yeah, because you mentioned one of them. Uh, Hamlet took place in Denmark, right? Yeah. So if there, one, there was one that took place in Scotland. Two-letter abbreviation for a prescription. PR? RX. Oh, yeah, okay. PR was too straightforward, yeah. Yeah, there's no okay, way. Okay, come on, we've got to get one here. Military rank and title of the president. Commander. Okay. Yeah. Commander-in-chief. What came to my mind was a Commodore. Uh, uh, that was wrong. Oh. Maybe yours is right. I but, don't know. Uh, yeah, because military rank. And it's funny because Commodore was actually removed as a military rank. Oh. Whoa. It's the one of the whole thing, Commander in Chief? Because oh. I know that. That's what I meant when I said, I wish I could buzz in again. Because now I know what they're looking for. I thought they just Commander would be good enough. Okay. Commander I, in Chief. I knew that. That's what I was going to say. Okay, that's okay. All right. Each wrote a Toccata and this. Few. Few, yes. Um. That was on a Phoenix Wright we heard it. Yes. Fugue. I just have to make sure I spell it correctly. What about an E? Yeah, I think it's spelled like that. F okay, if you think. I hope. I thought there might be. There we okay. go. Okay. Nice, yeah. Um, yeah, it's called a Fugue, yeah. Um, it starts with F. Let's do it. 300. Petrified remains of an animal or plant fossil. Hmm. Good one, yeah. Yeah. Uh, that I can spell. <laughs> yes, an easier word. Mm hmm. Okay. Uh, 400. All right, let's finish it off. A vacation granted to an enlisted man. Mm. Free time? Freedom? Let's see. Furlough? Oh, I didn't know that. Like, kind of like, reminds me of furlong. Maybe, yeah, Ness? Twin of Remus, he is the legendary founder of Rome. Romulus. Rom yeah, Romulus. Romulus, yeah. yeah. But can we spell it? Let's see. Rom. Romulus? I think yeah. it's I think it's O U S. Romulus. Or is it yeah. without the O? I don't know. Okay, okay. good. Yeah. yeah, Romulus and Remus. That's yeah. right. Um when he flew Oh Icarus. Yes. Yes. Who was a member of our team in Pokemon Sapphire. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're getting some ground here. Uh, the calm category, because we know it starts with that. Describes a multiple bone fracture. Mm. Mm. I feel I'll know it as soon as it comes up. Compound? Oh, really? Okay. Oh, no, I didn't know that. Um, I kind of thought of that, but I didn't want to say anything. Fruit stewed or cooked in syrup usually serves as, as a dessert. Or cooked in syrup. There's a tea. I don't know what. Hmm. I'll just let the timer run out on this one. Yeah. Compote? Okay. Never heard of it. Um, Finish the category. The act or process of understanding. Comprehension. Yeah. yeah. Maybe put the full thing in. Comprehension? Yes. Uh, uh. There you go. Okay. All right. Uh, three ones left. Medicine here. might be good for me. Okay. Instrument used... Oh, the stethoscope? Or is it something else? Stethoscope, right? I'm yeah. thinking that's what it is, yeah. 
how do you spell that? I think it's spelled like this. Yep. Okay. Yeah, that's a pretty basic one. Let's start the scoop. Quinine is the traditional cure for the symptoms of this tropical disease. Oh. Tropical disease? Am I thinking... I don't know why I'm thinking malaria. I keep thinking of hepatitis. Oh, oh but well, it's malaria. It was. Holy crap. Okay. Uh... This doctor specializes... In, oh, dermatologist. Okay. Do we see commercials for that on the TV sometimes? I think so, yeah. Yeah. Is Actually, it derma or, derma or dermo? Or derma? Uh... <laughs> You know, I'm gonna go back to A. Dermatologist? Instead of dermatologist or dermatologist? <laughs> I hope this is right. Yes. Okay, thank goodness. Uh, right. Last one. Gingivitis is an inflammation of the gums. Yeah. yeah. Gingivitis? Mm hmm. There we go. Okay, pretty good lead so far. Made with malt and barley, it's Scotland's lead to export. Uh, beer? I think. I think it's beer. Or is it rum? Sc oh, scotch. Yeah, why didn't I think of that? But you would have also had to say that other word. Probably. Yeah. Okay, whatever. It's small potatoes. Yeah. Small potatoes. Heavyweight boxing champion called the Brown Bomber. The only person I could think of is Muhammad Ali, but I don't... Mm, maybe. That's the only rest, uh, boxer I could think of. Joe Lewis. Well, I could think of a lot of boxers. In th my, uh, Tyson's punch out? Yeah. yeah. And Glass Joe. Glass Joe, yeah. He's French, though. National flowers, so called because they grow on heaths. A national flower of Scotland? That grows on my heath. Heather. Oh. Okay. Nicknames. Red haired singer known as the Divine Miss M. Is what it, the it heck? it's not Marilyn Monroe, is it? Well she wasn't really a singer though. Bet Melter? Okay. Hmm. Uh, right. Scotland. The Scottish last became an international star with Bond the Bond theme for your eyes only. Oh, I don't know, well. Sheena Easton. Hmm. Interesting. Larry's trying to make a comeback here. Yeah, yeah. British George O'Dowd is better known as this. King George the Third. I don't know. Uh, boy George. Okay. And last question. One left to go. Uh, lively dance named for mountainous region. Should, that was actually incorrect grammar in that sentence. Yeah, I'm not going to risk 500 on this one. Oh, Larry thinks he knows it, though. I think he does. Highland? Highland fling. Oh, okay. <laughs> what, did you fling a person? Oh! No! It's like, um, yeah, I thought there was a song that had something like that on it. Famous foursomes? Another calm question. Come on. What members of the... Comrade? My fellow comrades. Mm, comrade. Yep. Okay, uh... Famous. One name only fish. Comics at home. I don't know anything about Arizona, so... Maybe keep going with that category. Come on. The Upset Tragedy Comedy. comedy. Yeah. These common ones are easy. <laughs> oh. Comedy. It's so funny. There we go. Excellent. Okay. What else we got? Oh, Daily Double. I'm thinking maybe 500. 500 sounds good to me, yeah. <laughs> One kind helps you draw circles, the other... Compass. Oh, compass, yes. Yeah, that's easy. Okay. Uh, let's keep going. 
the Peanuts comic strip, it's what Lucy's doing, which is... Oh! Oh, are complaining? I don't know. see it. Yeah, I'm thinking that's it, yeah. But I just hope if we say complain and it doesn't accept it, maybe we should go say complaining yeah, just to be safe. Good, okay. That was a bit concerned there. Um, alright, let's finish it off. Oh, another one! What do you think? Should we go... We could do 700. 700? Or 655 or something? <laughs> <laughs> What's the number? 688. Okay. The day referring of conferring sc scholastic degrees. Oh. Uh, I don't know. Conferring scholastic degrees? Hmm. Compression? I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, I didn't know that one. Oh, they looked at us. Oh, they did? Yeah. Commencement, okay. Oh, okay. Mm. Well, now we oh, know. We still have the board. Yep. Comes. Oh. Krypton. Yes, I believe so. It's funny, we do. We got Crypto the dog in the last one. Right. Krypton, yeah. Yeah, looks good to me. Krypton. And his weakness is kryptonite. Yeah, I was thinking, yeah, that's kind of weird. Um, Red-haired, white-eyed orphan. Little Orphan Annie? You can go for it if you want. It's 400? We'll give it a shot. And I'll spell the whole thing. <laughs> yeah. Um, if I just say Orphan Annie or Annie, they probably won't accept it. Did you read about this one? No, but I've heard of it. Okay. Yeah. Doo -doo. Okay. Let's go for another one. Perennial Teenagers of this comic book series. Oh. Riverdale. Oh, I feel like I've heard of that. Martin Mystery. <laughs> Martin Mystery, yeah. Actually, oh, Archie. Oh, yeah. Martin Mystery did start as a comic book, you know. In oh, yeah? Italy, yeah. Oh. Georgia... <laughs> Akefanuki Swamp. Pogo, I haven't heard of that one. Alright, last one. Birth. Oh, country. Uncle Swamp. I think he's Scottish. Maybe he's that. There's a T in it. For Scottish? He has a Scottish accent, I think. Oh, we'll give it a shot. And well, it is a problem. But... That's okay. They haven't gotten anything. And if we get it, we'll have a really big lead. Nice. Yeah, because I've I've heard him speak, uh, Uncle Scrooge, and he talks with a Scottish accent. So. One so, name. Fashion model doll. Barbie. Yeah. There we go. All right. There was actually a question, and Barbie was the answer on the actual. Nice. Show, right. Not too long ago. Do you remember what the question was? N no. But what was the answer? Glittery pianist whose career spanned over 40 years. So it's only one name. Yeah. One name only. Liberace? Oh, great. We're going to Arizona. Well, some think this former senator glitters otherwise. Others think he's all wet. I don't know. Barry Goldwater. There's the hint. He's all wet. Yeah. But, uh, That's an old uh, phrase, all wet. That's when you're like a scoundrel or, or an outlier, I think. Okay. Red-haired singer who said bye-bye birdie. No, I don't know. Or, yeah, I think it's when you're a liar. You say, you're all wet. Whoa! <laughs> A lot of confusion there. It looks like he's having a heart attack. Like, or like a Von Karma, like... Yeah. yeah. Grabbing the arm. Yeah. Okay. Oh, these two are still trying to figure it out. <laughs> Anne Margaret. Anne Margaret, okay. Ooh. Uh, well, she could make a comeback. She could. Superstar hails from Minneapolis. Your guess is as good as mine, I don't know. 
Yeah. Okay, Larry, you're gonna reclaim that lead here. No, don't. <laughs> He's not going to make it for the final Jeopardy at this rate. No, he's almost $2,000 in debt. <laughs> Prince. Okay. Oh, he died not too long ago, didn't he? He did? I think he died, yeah. Not in this time frame. No, he did. No, I, I mean in the oh, 1987 yeah. time frame. Uh, this river, I don't know. Yeah, but yeah, in in uh, the future, the distant future of December eleventh, two thousand sixteen, he has passed away. I believe so. Yeah. Yeah. When? Oh, my mother would know this. Hitler on the roof. She was in that play. Oh, okay. Yeah. Top. Topo. Well, barrels catching up. Yeah, that was a tough category. Yeah. And, uh, well, we're still going. The largest Indian tribe. Oh. The Donacana tribe. Oh, Navajo. Navajo. Oh, I should have known that. That was a plot point in um, Beyond Two Souls. Oh. Of our, wait, what? Other half of U.S.'s supply of this metal uses middle layer of silver coins comes from... Tin? Of this metal. Tin? Copper. Copper. Interesting. In films, the Marx Brothers were... Oh, I don't know. I always find this, these Marx Brothers appearing in, in yeah. questions, but I never know. I don't know who they are. We should research it, I guess. We might have to. Fish. Okay, this could be okay. A man swims one pile, only one pile faster than this popular pet fish. Goldfish? Uh, that's, they swim four miles per hour? Oh, what well, we should have gone It was the only popular pet fish I could think of. Yeah, we should have buzzed that one. Was coming to this union, our flag then had this many stars. Thirteen. That's my guess. Well, let's see if he gives us a hint. Uh, it was three digits? Two? Two. Six. Ten. Well, oh, 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 we were off there. <laughs> two? No. <laughs> I don't think that's 48. Perch, tuna, and swordfish. The one that's a freshwater fish. So one of the three? Tuna? I think it's swordfish. Really? Yeah. Oh, uh, no. Nope. <laughs> Neither of us got it right. Well, Larry's, he needs the money anyway, yeah, so... Yeah, the barrel's caught up. Yeah. We need to, uh, get these. Bony plates? It's not gills, is it? They're not bony. Are they? Press the button. Okay. We'll try it. We need to get some money. It, we need to pretty much double her if we want a guaranteed win. Yeah. Now we oh, shouldn't have shoot. buzzed it. Mm. Overlapping bony plates. Oh, it's scales! <laughs> oh, I feel like an idiot now. Yep. Darn it. Okay. Spawns at night on sandy beaches, and by law can only be caught by hand. Hailbilly hand fishing. <laughs> uh. Spawns at night. It starts with a G. That's all I know. I think like a grandma grouper. <laughs> oh no. Grunya, no. Mm. I don't know that one. It looks like it's gonna come down to the final question. Oh, this is easy. Card, spade, diamond, clubs. Oh yeah. Now, what are they asking for? Will cards, cards be enough? I'll say playing cards just in case. Yeah. <laughs> it's only worth two hundred, but still, we need the points. Yeah, that's right. Cards. Okay, good. I'm glad they accepted that. Uh, all right, let's keep going. Porthos, Athos, Aramis, and Darta Dartag. Don't know where that's from. She's gonna get it right. Four, four mus musketeers. I thought there was three musketeers. Yeah. When was there a fourth one? Is that the sequel? <laughs> the spin-off? I don't know. Fish. Varieties of this whiskered fish. Oh, I'm thinking catfish. Cat you wanna go for it? Yeah. 
if it's whisker. I'm thinking pasta. I still remember that it was from like a horrible game show answer. Somebody said pasta to something that made no sense. Okay. Um, the only point in the U.S. common to four state boundaries. I don't know. I'm not a big geography guy here. What the heck? What? Is it that long of an answer? What the heck? Whoa! Whoa. Uh. The game's glitching! R-S-T-M-E? We have gone through the point of time and space here, ladies and gentlemen. Whoa! Corner's instrument. Okay. Um, Louisiana May Alcott's novel family. Oh, I know this one. <laughs> His score is so low it broke the game. That's what happened. Okay, well the answer to this is Little um, Little Women. Put it in. I just hope it gives us money and doesn't subtract it by the glitch uh, realm here. <laughs> Oh my goodness, yeah. Well, we're winning. We became a space alien, but we're still winning. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Dude. Bodies of water. You know, I don't think we should risk much. I think we're gonna win anyway. Just put like twelve dollars in or something. Or two sixty-seven. Two sixty-seven. Round our number off. Sure. But, but yeah. if the other lady gets it right, she'll win. If she bets it all, but well, you, they, I haven't. <laughs> Yeah, Larry, Larry broke existence, so I'm glad he's gone. She could maybe win. She, no, Four, she could. Five, I don't know. We should have maybe been a little more, but I don't know. Maybe by the Miguel could tranquilly look after his story passage. I don't know. I don't know. Magellan, because of its tranquil and peaceable look after his stormy passage. It's a body of water. Any yeah. idea? Sea? The Dead Sea? Yeah. Is, it is, maybe it's a bigger body of water. Just one of the oceans? Pacific? Atlantic? What's the third one? Arctic? Yeah, Antarctic. Antarctic. We gotta put in something. Lake Erie? I got nothing. Okay, we got it. Something? Pacific Ocean. Oh, okay. It was one of the big oceans. Oh, we're still in the glitch realm. <laughs> Larry didn't take part. <laughs> He's negative seventy-seven thousand one hundred dollars. Well, we okay. won the game. Seven thousand. Not bad. Good. Not bad. Yeah, I don't know what the hell happened there with Larry. He just destroyed uh, time and space because he was, his his score was so low, he broke the laws of physics. So, Larry, you can't play next time. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, come on, Larry. Uh, you know, you're just going to destroy existence as we know it. So next time on Jeopardy, maybe we'll pass into another parallel universe. You know. Survey says, I'd like to buy a vowel for 200, Alex. <laughs> we'll see you next time. You know, that's all. That's the extent of the parallel universe. They're all fusing into one. So uh, the ultimate, uh, the ultimate game. Yeah, it's every game combined. I wonder if you guys should do that. Well, we'll find out next time.